the variety of things we're taught. The fact that we get to cover so much ground. I enjoy how varied my course is while still going into a lot of depth. The balance between theory and practical work. You're really pushed in your learning, but you get to experience lots of different types of engineering, which I've all really enjoyed. You get to choose from a wide variety of modules. You don't even have to make them all of a similar topic. I could not have chosen my specialism before coming to Oxford. I personally don't think I could have picked what discipline of engineering I wanted to go into before I came to uni. I thought that mechanical engineering would be my specialism. I did apply for mechanical engineering at a couple of other universities before I came. I knew I wanted to go into sustainable development of infrastructure. I was really unsure about what specifically I wanted to do. I like a bit of everything and even now I still like quite a few things. It's definitely okay if you don't know what type of engineering you want to specialise in. That's why I picked a general course and that's why Oxford was so attractive to me. Since learning all of the different areas, it's made me realise that actually I have less of a clue of what area I want to study now than I did before. At this stage, I think I probably would still pick mechanical, leaning more towards turbo machinery. I really like the digital side of um, engineering and I like computer programming and software. Studying general engineering for the first two years definitely helped me see which sides of engineering I liked and which sides I didn't like as much. And now I feel more confident going and specialising in my third year. All the engineers come together at the department. So that's all the engineers from different colleges. There's about 160 of us and we have two lectures a day four to five days a week. The lectures are 50 minutes long and it's basically a professor or a lecturer standing up, talking to us whilst we listen and we take notes. There is a lot of information to take in in a short amount of time, but you don't need to stress about that because you're given lecture notes which have all the content in. You can go away, kind of digest the information. And also if there are things you still don't understand, that's what the tutorials are for. Each week you have two lecture series and for each lecture series, you have one associated tutorial. You're not just learning for the sake of it, you're learning why you learn these things and where they come in useful. So in a tutorial, you'll have one tutor and usually two to three students, and you'll go through your tutorial sheet on that lecture series, which usually consists of about eight to 10 questions, and you'll do that for an hour. The tutors can be academics, they could be DPhil students, quite often people who have only recently started their DPhil. Quite a lot of them went to Oxford, so they really understand the graduate process and it's quite nice having someone who's very recently done exactly what you were doing. Really, really useful. One of the best things about the Oxford course. I really like the tutorial system. It helps you get to grips with the content that you've covered in lectures and make sure that you don't get left behind if there's something that you're kind of struggling with. Having that almost one-to-one -one attention from your tutors allows you to fully grasp all the hard bits within the course or go into detail on something you find really interesting. It's also helpful to have other people in your cohort in that small group as well, because you can bounce ideas off each other, understand their perspectives, see something from maybe a completely different point of view. And it just allows you to kind of broaden your thinking. Sometimes even if you aren't prepared or you didn't really understand, you come out feeling a lot more confident in the subject. I absolutely love our tutors and I think that they're really, really helpful. They're amazing. The number of times where I've had extra tutorials or I've stayed, you know, up to an hour extra has been very beneficial to me because it's a difficult degree and I've really struggled with it. That's fine. My tutors are okay with that. They're still willing to help. All of our lecturers and tutors are also doing their own projects as well. So it's sometimes really cool to learn about them and what they're doing. It's nice how you can apply what you've learned in the labs. Labs are quite tiring but interesting and hands-on. I really enjoy the practical labs. I have found the labs at Oxford extremely tough and intense. They're about five hours, but they're also the most satisfying thing because at the end of the day, you know that you've done what you need to do and you can kind of just take the rest of the afternoon to chill. <laughs> In our first year, we got to make a bridge, a radio, look at engines. We also did quite a lot of computer programming in MATLAB. And I found all of this really interesting. And as an engineer, I loved doing some hands-on practical work as well. I did find them quite hard, possibly a bit dull at the start, but I think when you really try and do your background reading, then they are really enjoyable and they definitely get progressively more interesting the ones at the end of second year. The computer labs. Bridge building, building a radio and building a mini walking robot. 
You don't need any coding experience whatsoever. They teach MATLAB from scratch, which is really interesting and really, really useful for other parts of our degree as well. At the end of second year, then you get three full weeks of labs in a variety of topics. And that is really just for looking at what sort of discipline you want to go into. And I love those. It is really intense, but I absolutely love it. And it was the best decision that I've made. I say that I love it. I tell them I absolutely love it, but it is quite intense. I think it was really hard at first, but I grew into the degree. The more you specialise and the more you do what you find really interesting, the more you get out of it. If you like fast-paced learning, learning a lot of new concepts, then it's definitely right for you.